safari ride. Kilimanjaro safari. You ready to do that? They say run a bunch of It's very bumpy out there, don't want one flying out of the truck. Also, do not lean outside of the truck. Many of the bushes have long, sharp spikes. I do not want anyone impaled. It's another category of bad. Of your heads are animal spotting guides. Help you identify the animals we'll be seeing in the savannah. Granite superfluous. We'll be talking about them as well. But there's an animal you see. I don't. You wonder what it is? We'll look up. It's up there. If it is not to call Warden Matula, it knows an unusual animal in the reserve that bears investigation. We're next in line for clearance of the reserve. Very technical. And all for us, I don't know for what I'm <clears throat> Boy, the details. But when that light's completely solid. We're clear for the reserve to let go. Everyone is intently staring at a light bulb. That's fantastic. Bodes well for the next two weeks. I think Warden Matua has switched the back. He flicks on and off when he's ready to send us in the reserve. Here we are. Clear for the reserve. Start our journey in the interior force. As we enter the reserve, keep our eyes open. Animals are attached to camouflage, blending with the background, confusing predators. Game drivers alike. No copy to the right. Striped legs would make you think they're part of the zebra family. They're not. Only no relative of the giraffe. Very reclusive, only discovered by the Western world in 19... Right behind that door. Look, right behind the tree. Yeah, you're right behind the tree. Look back. Settle build. Start to the left. You're going to be five feet tall with a wingspan of nine feet across. This is going to be Quite a distance from here, so I'd say sit back, relax, get comfortable. Take a nap. I'll let you know when we reach the river. Over there. <laughs> Time and space skew from here in Africa. Sometimes two weeks fly by like 20 minutes. Strange. Don't know how that works. <laughs> On the island are pink-backed pelicans. Get the name for the pink colorization their backs receive during mating season. <laughs> oh my goodness! 
As we round the bend, we're going to be approaching the Suricali Bridge, a very old rickety bridge that has seen better days. As we cross, you'll see why no one stands during safari. Nine times out of ten, we see Nile Crocodile. It'll be 20 feet long, running at speeds of 10 miles per hour. With their jaws open, they regulate their body temperature, but they can snap shut with bone-crushing forces of 2,000 pounds per square inch. They get out of here as long as we're joined together. All together. And so we caress the energy hill. We'll be entering an entirely different ecosystem. Hopefully, see an entirely different set of animals as well. Speaking different, there's a baobab tree. Also known as an upside down tree, it'll grow leafless nine months out of the year. Massive trunk holds a great deal of water, and the Serengeti grassland stretches hundreds of miles across East Africa. The superhighway for millions of migratory species home some of the four famous animals lion, elephant, zebra. All part of the wild Africa we're trying so hard to protect. The side giraffe. Spot pattern, very leaf like and edged. Unlike that of the reticulated giraffe, getting its name from the Latin word reticulata, meaning net. Describing its net like pattern of spots. Tallest animals in the world, reaching heights of 20 feet. Also known as the painted dog, because they are even greater than the hyena, not related to hyena in any way. They'll run their prey to exhaustion before making the kill. White, also bearded 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 new. We're getting the name from the noise of an underbank, which sounds like new. Who's did I coming up with that? There's enough food for everyone. Oh, 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 Massive horns may look incredibly heavy, but are mainly hollow with blood vessels running through them, regulating their body temperature and cooling them down. Springbok. The little guys are able to repeatedly jump 10 feet in the air. You can tell he's a male because he's on his own. Females and calves stick together in herds, but males will just wander around. Search whatever males wander around and search whatever. Typically food. Does not end well for a species when they're what? Oh, that's not good. That's the road to elephant territory, the only way I know to get there, which apparently washed away. I have no idea where that goes. That's not in our route. I could jump it. <laughs> I could. Not going to. I just won this truck in a game of Sabak against Ward Matula last night. We go left, find out what this does lead. Wrong turn, we'll come back, try jumping it later. We have two weeks left for all playing time for rash decisions. <laughs> if we get too lost, I can always get the map out of the glove compartment. I'm a man. I don't need a map. 
great. Another old bridge. Well, looking on the title, folks, no worries. Take it bully, bully, very slowly. Hope for the best. Keep those fingers crossed. Looks maintained, just a little rusty. It's still good. <laughs> still good. Where this road came from. Ah, now I know. Knowings at the battle where the red plague bits. Tuskmarks look for to show that elephants have in here the way that red plague and the nutrients that are finding all the elephants. Largest cat in Africa. Largest cat in those hunting in packs called Rye. Bomb to buck. Unfortunately extinct in the wild. Thankfully he's still in the reserve. How cool is that, buddy? Those big old cats. Yeah. Can you imagine one of them scratching your legs? Oh, way back here, lots of churches. See the off face of that that's a That looks like a little bit of a Poachers, camping in our land, hunting our animals. We took care of them. Took over their campsite, turned it into a habitat for one of the rarest species in the reserve. Distinctive horns, shaped like the Arabian sword. Well, these gates are at the edge of the reserve, so our two week safari is just about over. Now I'll be taking you to the warden post to be able to disembark. Also, a few feet away from the entrance of Gorilla Falls Exploration Trail. Making closer views of Hippo. 